Tilla Tamashum, 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 Today we're acting to a trailer of a film. It's called something. Waiting. Radica, 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 Radica. That's from that new Danush film. I know. Yeah. I know because when we did the most recent reaction to it without that song. Comments galore. Radical, okay. radical, radical. Oh, it's one of my favorite songs. <laughs> yeah. still. It's radical update song. Yeah. Uh, it's called Waiting. It's a Hindi film with Nasser and Shah. What? Uh, Cocky Kick. Shirtless, I hope, for your sake. Porn and I was just about to, when we were talking about radical, 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 I was just going to think, I was thinking of, and just going to say, where's Kalki? It's been so long since we've seen Kalki in something. Yeah, it has. Uh, well, she did just have a baby. Uh, not too. Uh, yes, not her too and Shreya Goshal. Trey Goshal had a baby. Yep. Yeah, a little baby muscular dove. Yep. Um, but yeah, this is uh, Nasir Shah mamas. and Koki Kaiklin uh, for, for a Hindi film. Tara, a married woman, meets Shiv, an elderly professor at a hospital where their spouses are admitted. The two develop an extraordinary friendship as they get to know each other. Cool. Okay. Cool. I like it. Uh, you know the acting's going to be there with uh, <laughs> Nasir and... Uh, and I uh, did not know they'd ever done a film together, which is pretty common nowadays where we discover, oh... You guys work together? It seems like all of our favorites have worked together. Yep. Happens a lot in Hollywood, too. We like good actors. No. And uh, good actors like good actors. Yes. Good actors like good actors. Here we go. Is it that, is it that doctor who was talking to Nasseridin? Is that him? Hold on. Sorry. Uh, it looks great. Oh, let's talk about the trailer. It yeah. looks like a beautiful movie. Mm -hmm. Looks like a very touching, very sweet, very emotional, uh, both really funny at times, but also deep. Kind of like, um, it's a very different kind of film, but what it gives me the sense of in terms of it being both funny and deeply emotional is, doggone it, what's that film? Um, uh, oh, it's gonna drive me crazy. Which one? 
It's the true story. It's not that guy that I was thinking of. Just like, okay. It's the true story. Um, it's also 90 minutes, this film. Really? <laughs> it, it's the true story of um, a, a stand-up comic and how he met uh, his wife. It did really well on oh, his... Oh, you're talking... Um, with Ray Romano in it, yeah, with them. No, I know what you're talking about. You're talking about... Um, Love uh, is in the title. Uh, the Big Sick. The Big Sick. Sorry, Love is... Thank you. With... Um, 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 I love him. I know, uh, me too. What's his name? I Hold know. on. It's... I know. He's in the new Eternals film. I know. I see his face. I would have said it if I could have remembered it right off the top of the bat. I'm going to be... But... I know him. This... Gives me the same kind of sense that this is going to be both. Because that movie, that's a great movie if you haven't seen it. Kamil Nanjani. That's him. Uh, the, that movie is a, a really good movie about serious, serious. One of my favorite films of that year. Yeah, I very serious. Film. Heavy at times. Great message. Really funny mm -hmm. at times. And this gives me the same vibes. And obviously it looked great with Javi Sinda Sajan Shah and Kulti oh. uh, acting in... They looked wonderful. Yeah, just give, uh, them, give them a lot of dialogue together, please. Uh, yeah, this looks great. I would, I would see this film um, without, without question. Also, it's just it's one of those scenarios you could just put yourself in, and it's it's an awful thing to think about. It is like that's probably the worst thing I can think of if like something happened to my wife or child and they were in a coma or whatever. Yeah, happened to them and they were just not. And somebody would ask, "Is this what they?" Were, I don't give a shit. Right. I would rather have my wife than money. Thank right. you. Yeah. And fuck off. Yeah. Right. It's like, are you going to put a price tag on it for me? <laughs> like, it's, it's dumb. Of course life is more important than money. <laughs> well, I don't know because, you know, there are a lot of husbands who at the end of the day, their thought would be, I don't know. I mean, should I have that money or should I keep my wife? Mm. Yeah. Duh! Yeah. It's, uh... Ah. Uh, I, 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 I be shocked if actually this ends happy. And it, it won't surprise me as well if one of the deep issues it gets into is end of life scenario. Yeah. And and because a lot of people, some people plan for it, a lot of people don't. I'd say probably most don't yeah. in terms of what the family members can do. And if you don't have that, then it's up to the family member to make that decision. And that's a really weighty decision to have to make. Uh, and I'm the, I don't know what it's called. I'm the one in charge for both of my parents when they die. Which I think... Oh, yeah. I don't the, know what um, the, the name is called. Uh, it's not power of attorney. There's another word for yeah, it. Yeah, but like... It's they, a single word. They've put everything in their will, but I'm the person that makes sure whatever's in their will... Right. ...happens. The, um... Something that starts with an E or something like that. Um, they tried to talk to... Both sets! Because I my, my parents, my original parents, mom and dad, are divorced from when I was like three years old. Right. And they both remarried. Two wonderful people who I love, and but they've both like in the past couple of years because even though they're not old, they're like my mom's like 55, I think is the she's oldest, and um, dad's about the same age. But they've started to like talk about that stuff, and shocked to me because you know, growing up, I was the trouble child, but right <laughs> now I'm the one in charge when somebody <laughs> dies. I don't know what that I don't like it. Do they also have as part of their will or their living trust? End of life scenarios, like they don't want extraordinary measures done. Yeah, yeah, they have it's all stuff like that in there. Yeah, it's all I'm not way. asking for the specifics, obviously. I'm just, did, I'm sure they covered that. Yeah, they have. It's, yeah, it's all of them have wills. Cause yeah, my, my dad, my stepdad is a uh, paralegal. He's worked in uh, with lawyers for a long, long time. Yeah, and so he's. Dad, what's that term? I, now you're driving me crazy. Yeah, episode. The, I don't the know. I think it's it has to do with actuating it. The, I think it's mostly because I'm. I don't, even though I would be emotional, obviously, with my own parents, but, like, I'm not, like, emotional when, in terms of what I'm, and what I'm thinking, I don't yeah. think with my emotions. No, and it's it's good, too. Like, I did that with my, like, my grandma. I had, she had a living trust, and I had power of attorney for her, and uh, she had particular things that she wanted to have done, and you do. The reason that's usually good is because the that person and no one's going to care more that everything's done right yeah well because like you in i've dealt with it before with like my my grandma who died a long time ago but like my dad and his sisters his sisters were very emotional and like they 
fight because she didn't have a will so there was like a bunch of fighting in the family about yeah who gets what which is i think completely idiotic yeah uh, <laughs> like i've always wondered that i was like i don't expect anything when my parents die i've never even had like the thought of like oh i can't wait no, till I, I get this right i just assume that stuff like went away it's like i don't want anything <laughs> right yeah. at all but like you kind of have to have it in case certain stuff happens with family coming in and mm -hmm. then the state could take over and you don't want the government to get involved. <laughs> yeah, no, very true. Ever. <laughs> and I don't know what the laws are like in that regard yeah, in, in India, India as well, but I, anyway, come on, that looks this great. This film looks great. Let us know how it is. Should it be the next Kulki and Nasseruddin film that we watch? Down below. <laughs> Josh!